life, how do you keep your feet firmly planted on the That was my training from the beginning. Uh, since uh, I was with my mother, and then with my sister, and then with other uh, human leaders. Uh, the training I had with my sister is my uh, fundamental uh, development of my character. That was when uh, these uh, formative years, uh, well, it began with my mother, you know, those values instilled, even though we are poor, we are not that rich, but the values instilled in us, uh, parents who are very strict when it, when it comes to discipline, parents who are very strict when it comes to m m uh, your, uh, your uh, morals, parents who are very strict when it comes to obedience. And then, uh, at, uh, at the age of, uh, like when I was in grade five, my uh, tutor uh, was my sister, took over the discipline over me. And it was triple, quadruple strict. Uh, every move, you know, is being monitored and everything is being supervised every day of your life. So I grew up with a very strict tutor, no mercy. So when the father called me, uh, first in the denomination and then uh, to the other human leaders in Kitbug, and finally when I was under the tutorship of the Almighty Father in Tamayo, it all helped me. I always testify to you about how he trained me. He trained me how to live uh, like a royal with all the rights and amenities of a royal. And he taught me also how to become a slave. Because if I cannot be a slave, I cannot be a king. If I, if I, if I don't learn how to be a slave in obedience to your, to your uh, master, in all things, then I cannot be a king to order and to give rules. If I cannot be a good follower, I cannot be a good leader. So the father taught me that, how to live like a royal in all the uh, rights and all the uh, privileges. And he also taught me how to become a slave and even be treated like a criminal without any rights at all. Just you know, kick you on the side. And the father uh, was uh, looking at my reactions on those sit situations and instances. My reaction and my, uh, my demeanor is always, Father, my love for you do not change. Amen. If you, if you, if you uh, put me anywhere, it is your will. I will, I will love to do your will. If I become a a janitor in your, uh, in your kingdom, if you put me anywhere, as long as this you will, I will love it and I will, I will do whatever you want me to do in that capacity. So he treated me like that. And when I had passed the, uh, the tests, then he, he sent me. And so you see how I live right now. I can live to the lowest rank of a worker and I can live to be a king with all the amenities and privileges in life. And my focus is always, almost always, only on the Father's will. Amen. Whether I am up or down, my, my goal and my focus is how to do His will, how to be excellent in doing His will, how to please Him in whatever situation in life. Look at these people who have not been praying like that. But they show the example in me. Amen. Look at what they did. They became corrupt with just a little privilege, with just a little blessing. Nakakabit lang. Para silang langaw, nakatuntong sa kalabaw. Ang, pang, ang kanilang pakirandang, parang kalabaw na rin sila. Lumaki ang ulo. O, kaya pala may isang kapatid dito na nung nakita niya yung buhay ko nung pumunta ng Amerika, sabi niya, Pastor, kung uh, ako pa sa iyo, wala ng kingdom ngayon. Totoo nga, nung umuwi siya, pinagpala ng konti. 
Nawala na, nawala na yung business niya. Nagbabae na, nagsugal na, umiinom na, kasama na ng mga ng bababae na. Lahat ginawa na niya. Handa naubos yung pera niya. Kaya pala matakaw na siya sa pera dahil may babae na, nagminom na, tapos lahat. So, bankrap. No. Kung siya nasa lugar ko, ano yung gagawin niya? But look at how I live. Look at how I am focused only on the Father's will. No pride of life, no lust of the flesh, no lust of the eyes. All of my focus is only how to do his business here successfully, propagate it, glorify him with honor, integrity, and commitment, dedication, and uh, loyalty to his will only. That is how I live every day. I can eat good food. I can eat any kind of food you serve before me. I can sleep in any pahat. I can sleep in a palace. It's all the same to me. As long as I am focused only on the Father's will. On what pleases Him every day. Yun lang. Amen.